With the tourism industry hit hard by COVID, a local holiday spot is bucking the trend. Rockingham's enjoying a boom in day trips with more than a million of us visiting last financial year. For more, we are joined by local mayor Barry Samuels. Thank you for coming to Perth. Thanks, Mon. Barry, you must be feeling rather proud of your coastal community. Day trips to Perth, Mandra and Frio, they all fell. What are you doing differently? Uh, we undertook a marketing strategy and uh, out of that there was a number of initiatives that we've uh, undertaken to promote the city and uh, a new brand, Rediscover Rockingham. Um, obviously done some of that marketing on Destinations WA on Nine as well and a number of billboards around the area and, and obviously that's starting to pay off. Well, what's happening your way may come as a slight comfort to other local operators who are still doing it tough. What's your message to them? Well, what we're saying to everybody is um, we like to work with the local Chamber of Commerce and identify um, areas that we can improve in. Um, we're saying to the local businesses that we, uh, we're supporting them and we will continue to do that. Now, Perth residents were still allowed to go to Rockingham during the first regional lockdown. Now we can venture further. How will you maintain the momentum, Barry, and keep people coming your way? Well, we'll keep marketing it, Monica, and, uh, you know, we'll also be doing, uh, promoting the area, you know, where the aquatic playground there, down there, uh, rediscover Rockingham, as I said. You know, we've, we've got the north-facing beach. Um, you know, we've undertaken a uh, $16 million renovation of a foreshore only about 18 months ago. Um, and the businesses down there are starting to get the benefits of all those. Talk us through your ultimate Rockingham day trip then. Well, you couldn't do it all in a day, Monica, unfortunately, but I'll, I'll put you in the scenario that we'll get you on a plane and we'll drop you out of that plane and you can land on the foreshore. We'll then pick you up in a boat, take you out and you can um, visit Penguin Island, Seal Island. You can go diving with the dolphins. We'll then take you to one of our award-winning restaurants on the foreshore for lunch, take you out to one of our wineries, do a little bit of shopping on the way through. We'll take you back to the foreshore where you can uh, watch the sunset go down with some fish and chips and overlook Garden Island. How's that for a start? Well, it sounds like some fabulous adventure tourism. Um, you suggest that it can't just, you, you can't see it all in one day. You're now encouraging people to stay over, are you? Well, absolutely. We've got accommodation down there, good quality accommodation. People love coming to Rockingham. You know, we've, we're the aquatic playground. We've got so many of those sports to do, you know, windsurfing, fishing, there's Coburn Sound. Um, so there's lots to do. You're not going to do it in a day. So we're encouraging people that want to come down, come down, stay with us, stay for a couple of days and enjoy what uh, Rockingham has got to offer. And it really is only just a 40 minute drive from Perth or even less if you're on the train. Well, I came up on the train today, so, uh, you know, 35 minutes on the train. There um, you have it. It's a casual drive, but uh, come and rediscover Rockingham. Well, your sunny beaches are bound to draw tourists this weekend. Mayor Samuels, all the best. My pleasure.